I'm the flyest to ever walk in here. You might be missing and wondering who the fuck this is. My making. Thank you guys for tuning in, man. Y'all know what this is. This is JFK's way. I'm JFK, man. I am the coolest comic book collector out with the most fitted hats without a doubt, man. That's like my slogan. So uh, I'm taking that and I'm running with that, man. The coolest comic book collector out. Gotta have the most fitted hats without a doubt, man. Until I meet another guy to collect comics that's on it like I'm on it. But anyway, today, man, I want to present something to you guys. I know I said my next video was going to be a comic video, but yo, I got this in the mail and I just, I couldn't wait, man. I couldn't hold the anticipation. I've been looking forward to this hat. Uh, actually, when I when I caught wind of it and seen it, uh, it was actually already gone. So uh, I actually had to wait pretty much for a slight remake for some some adjustments and stuff they was doing over there. So first and foremost, uh, shouts out to the guys over at Capologist. Uh, I believe the guy that runs his name is Leon. So I'm actually part of a group uh, FHS. I know there was like a little thing going on where there was a separation with them, but in, in light of that, I actually do say some of the stuff they do make is quality stuff. And I had to support it. You know what I'm saying? I had to. Fitted hats is fitted hats. Uh, we are in a community of people that collect. And it's hard to meet genuine collectors these days. Like, it really, really is. You know, guys that love it. Guys not just chasing a buck. So, uh, this hat right here that I'm going to show you guys. Uh, again, I had to support the tiger, man. You know what I'm saying? That this is a very, very exquisite tiger. Something that is not widely known about. Something that's not everywhere. You're not going to walk in no stores and see it. So, you know how I am, man. I love rarity over popularity. Rarity over popularity. That's like my thing, right? So let's get straight into this. Let's bust this box open. And um, and like I said, man, actually, I'm going to be showing you guys real soon some of my favorite logos just in general, some stuff that I decide I'm going to be doing myself. Uh, I'm going to be, you know, again, getting blanks, getting licensed, official new era hats, and getting them actually, you know, done and get some customization going myself. So uh, just some ideas I had. You know, it doesn't seem like nobody's reaching out. So I'm going to reach out. So hopefully, you know, if, and if, the, if it's accepted enough, if certain people like it, I'll get others done for other people. But right now, we're going to start with, man, I got the stickers. I got the sticker. Thank you for the sticker, Leon. Um, and I'm going to just show you guys the back of this first. Because, man, oh, man. Year of the Tiger, y'all. Year of the Tiger. Uh, this is a hat. I, I don't care, man. I'll be wearing this for the next 12 years. Sad patch. That you have not seen, that you will not see everywhere. Glory, glory, very, very well done. New era, as you guys see, right there. Now this kanji actually letter inside the side patch that means tiger. Uh, and then I'm gonna give you guys the glory of boom. Now what you see is definitely, definitely a jolly tiger. He's definitely happy. He's definitely excited. I'm not gonna say he's on nothing. But uh, this is not a, a, a LSD or, or a coked out tiger. Nah, it's not. But this tiger is, oh uh, man, this is all around. Just a great hat, man. Like I said, as soon as I seen this, I, I, wanted, I wanted to be a part of what was going on. I definitely had to get my hands on one of these. And again, you know, that's my phone going off. Y'all know I was born in the year of the tiger, man. So I definitely got to flaunt this. Y'all see the tiger over the kanji over there. The, the, you see the tiger tail, which is crazy because if you look at this, it's like his tail is missing on this. Right? He doesn't even have a tail in this at all. You just see his pants, you see his, see his butt or whatever. But you see the tail on the back of this. So if that was the idea, yo, Leon, you guys killed this one, man. Uh, and again, I'm, I'm extremely happy to have this. I believe a lot of people's version that they had was navy. I think there was a navy and a black version. Uh, you know me, man. I'm anti-blue, man. I don't do blue too much of anything, man. I'm from the other side. From the other side. We do things to the right side. So I had to definitely, definitely get the black. Um, I'm just honored to have it. Like I said, the side patch is well done. Uh, this is my size, baby. So, whew, I'm hyped to have this, man. The year the Tiger just gets better, man. You know what I mean? The year the Tiger just gets better. So, a uh, shout out to the guys over, over at Capologist. Uh, hey, and if you're a fitted hat collector like me, man, support the real. You know what I mean? Buy what you like. Rock what you like. You know what I mean? Fight the hype. Like I said, rarity over popularity. And um, what I will be doing, man, like I said, you guys stay tuned. Hit that subscribe button. Hit me in the comments. Uh, check me out on Instagram. Uh, JFK the Great. Um, but I promise you guys, uh, I just I recently just did a bison, a bison hat. Actually, this was like earlier in the year, like like six months ago. But I did a bison literally before the end of the year, top of the new year. And uh, I showed people and I was hoping, you know, I would have got some reception. Some people liked it. Some people just like, you know, nobody's going to reach out to you. They're just going to take your idea. Surely, but slowly, right after that, maybe about two months after that, my footage released a, a glow in the dark bison as well. So, like I said, it's just something I, I've never seen done before. Uh, my version, of course, even if you look publicly in the internet, mine just put up in a group first. I am going to be showing you guys some of my ideas, man. I'm just like, you know what? 
I like to keep my stuff to myself. I like that, but right now I'm like, I need to get out there. I need to, you know what I mean? Get, get, give, give my ideas to some of the other people and see what they think about it. See if, see if the reception is good. And if they're received well, then I will be uh, pushing out my own edition of hats uh, real, real soon. Again, just my favorite logos. I'm not going all through the, you know, and I don't do alphabets. So for those that know, I do not really wear alphabets hardly ever. Um, I'm a logo, logo kind of guy. So hence the, hence the, y'all see the mountains, man. Y'all see the, Hence the logos, man. I'm not walking around with a big ass D on top of my hat. I just, I don't understand why people do that. Or a big ass F on my hat. Like, what? You know what I mean? So, uh, but yes, man, yo, listen, peace and love. Thank you guys for tuning in. And yo, stay tuned, man. I'll be dropping another video soon. But like I said, get in tune with me, man. I will be dropping my own stuff real, really, really soon. It'll be definitely small, limited numbers. Uh, mine's, of course, first. I'm going to be going through doing the betas, doing the, the first, you know, actual mods of it. So I'll be showing you guys the beta hats. And if it's well received, then I'll be putting out more for a few people. You guys get in contact with me. But, yo, hit that subscribe once again, man. Hit the like, hit the comments, and peace and love. And I will catch you guys on the next one. I'm the flyest to ever walk in here. You might be listening, wondering.